Williams will back it out. Morris will let it fly. Why not? It's been that kind of night for the LSU Tigers. That three rims out. LSU has it. Morris has to get it across. Kim Mulkey in year two has orchestrated a turnaround for the ages. LSU has captured its very first national championship. Clark gathers her group after their valiant run for the championship game. Angel Reese celebrates with the freshman Flage Johnson. And you can hear Kim Markey saying to Caitlin Clark, you're a generational player. All class from Kim Markey. What a year for Lisa Bruder. Coming up with the shocking upset of South Carolina in the semis. But it's Kim Mulkey and LSU who prevail this afternoon. 102 85 the final. And Kim Mulkey is with Holly Rowe. She, she wants her granddaughter and grandson with her. And coach, they say you can always go home again, and you did. And now you're bringing a trophy with you. How does this feel to bring a trophy home to Louisiana? This is one of the most improbable championships you could even write a script for. You had one player on the roster coming back. How did you assemble this group of women together, and how did they come together to be so strong in this moment? Well, I have personalities, and I think a lot of these personalities coaches want to be scared of. I'm not afraid of that. I played with personalities in college. I played with a personality myself. They just are ballers. and. Golly, Holly, I, I, I'm just stunned. I'm uh, blessed. I'm appreciative. It's Palm Sunday. I just, wow. Go enjoy this with your team, Coach. Thank you. Kim Mulkey, it's just her second year after taking over this nine-win program, leads LSU to its first championship. And now she stands alone third when it comes to most titles for any head coach in the history of women's college basketball. Angel Reese talked about needing Kim Mulkey. The way she brought out the best in her. And Angel Reese after the game, finishing the way she started this season. LSU has been a confident group throughout. And Angel Reese is with Holly Rowe. Angel, you were in foul trouble to start this game. How did this group come together in the locker room at halftime and really come together in the biggest moment to win this national championship? It's no one-man show around here. When I go down, the next man is up every single time. Every time I go up, goes out everybody always comes to step up steps up Samaya came in as a freshman everybody from the big Jasmine Carson are you telling me 21 points in the first half that's what we needed from her and I'm super excited and happy for this team oh my I, God. I, 
watch you all season long, your leadership, you hold your teammates accountable. Sometimes it's hard conversations. How have you led this group to a national championship? Hey, my teammates take constructive criticism. I get on them, they get on me, and it's all positive, but we know we're just trying to get each other better. So this team is just amazing. We built each other up from the summertime, and I'm so happy. Kim said you have so many different personalities, and it took a lot of different ones to get here. When you're celebrating and you guys realize that this is within your grasp, what did you say as you came together? Breathe and believe. That's all we did all year. Just take a deep breath and just keep believing in each other. Nobody thought we were going to be here. Nobody. As long as we believed in each other, I don't even know what to say right now. I'm just so happy. All that mattered is you believed you could be here, Angel. Thank you. I appreciate you, Holly. Thank you. <laughs> Angel Reese, a champion for LSU. The Tigers able to end the incredible run from Caitlin Clark in Iowa. 102-85, the final. We'll be back in a moment for the championship trophy presentation. The LSU Tigers. Take down Caitlin Clark in Iowa. What a contest in Dallas.